Nobody does Star Wars like the power of the Force from Kenner. Hey Star Wars fans and action figure collectors, welcome to another episode of Power of the Force Friday. We're looking at the droid, this the droid 4LOM, he's not Zuckers, he is 4LOM. <laughs> I know, I get it. Um, this is an interesting one, honestly. Um, I just I feel like the, uh, the paint on this one is very strange. I've really gone for that sort of rusted out junk look all over the figure except the head so yeah it's 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 an interesting interesting choice so yeah he's got his weapon there i'm not sure if that's original with this figure or not i assume it's probably similar um yeah i'm not sure i've probably got it somewhere if not doesn't really matter i've got one that's good enough uh yeah i like 4 LOM, I think he's cool. I actually really like what they've done with other figures of him. He's coming out of the Vintage Collection, and that was a really good one. Um, Black Series again, really good, really good 4 LOM. Um, even had the sort of painted head, which was cast in clear green plastic, so you get that sort of green luminescence of the eyes when you shine different lights through it, which was a really cool feature. Uh, yeah, I actually like his vintage figure quite a lot from uh, 1980 or 1979, depending on when it was made and put out. I wasn't there. <laughs> I don't remember. I wasn't existing yet. <laughs> but yeah, I like I like Fallon. I like this sort of notion that a droid has been programmed to, uh, you know, do a menial job, do a job that, you know, everyday citizens would do and droids are usually you know they're basically like an appliance to be programmed to have enough sort of will and consciousness to take on work as a bounty hunter is really interesting to me a sort of artificial intelligence sort of thing I guess the same same with IG-88 really um, but the fact that 4LOM became you know good friends with Zuckus is a uh, something I find really interesting, that sort of pairing. But I actually like the uh, the chest armor there, it's like plating, like an armadillo sort of thing there, which is uh, sort of very different to um, other protocol droids. Whereas for the most part, like the legs and arms, they look pretty similar to most protocol droids, like, you know, C-3PO for example. Um, but yeah, that chest is um, unique to 4 LOM, I believe. I'm not sure what the little red mark there is in the chest. I'm not sure whether that's meant to be there, whether that's just a uh, paint defect. Never really, never really thought about it. But yeah, I still think the paint, <laughs> that rusted look is a little bit strange, but uh, yeah, I mean, just take a look at some of the sand troopers they've done in the past. They look a little bit weird too, with that sort of really heavy, he looks like he's just been pulled out of a sand pit or something, and the dirt's all suck all over him. But it's cool, man. I like I like Fallol a lot. Cool, cool head sculpt. I like his eyes, that look good. Oh, I assume that's his eyes. Big sensory, optical sensory glands of some description. Uh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Meant to be a droid, but there's a you know an interesting looking natural biological sort of look to those big green patches, which yeah I've always assumed are his eyes. And without going and reading Wikipedia, which I can't be bothered doing, I'm just going to have to pretend. Because <laughs> yeah, I'm, I can't be bothered Wikipediaing everything to get my facts right. Um, yeah, love to hear your thoughts on 4LOM, which apparently means for love of money, which is uh, makes sense. 
But uh, yeah, I don't know how, how true that is or whether that's just a fan thing that they've come up with over the years. For LOM, for love of money, that's why he works. Yeah, really interesting stuff. Love to see more for LOM. So thank you very much guys. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do. I do Power of the Force Fridays every, almost every single week. <laughs> I've always got to remember throwing that almost because some weeks I don't do it. Um, but yeah, thank you very much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. Until my next video, may the Force be with you always.